Hey, how's it going, man? Got this question I saw on your Quora here. It says, uh, I feel unconnected to society, people's feeling, lives, and I feel void and uninterested. I've always been so, but it grows with time. What's happening? I'm gonna tell you something that gonna, I relate with you a lot, more than you realize. I'm gonna imagine that you're pretty young. I'm 33, I'm not old by any means, but I have a lot of experience. And I'll tell you right now that I feel what that feels like. I can remember what that feels like. I was listening to Nine Inch Nails, Offspring. Um, what else was I listening to? Nirvana and uh, Smashing Pumpkins. Basically all depressing sort of angry rock, I guess you can say alternative music. Santeria. It's not Santeria. It's, um, what's that? Sublime. And I'm going to tell you right now that a lot of what you're feeling, why you feel unconnected, is because you're not connected. I know this is obvious, but to be more specific even to this whole idea of being unconnected is because you're afraid to connect. And I sigh with this kind of weird sigh because I, I know what that feels like. And it's not simple to have someone say to you, oh, you just connect with people, go meet people, right? It's, it's not that simple because you're like in your bubble. You know, I actually still have a bubble for myself. I guess everyone does. I have my own little bubble, right? And I, I can't, I can't, I don't want to talk to anybody. I don't want to connect with anybody. And the truth is, that, and this is, might be hard for you to swallow, this idea is that you're just afraid. You're afraid to connect with people. You're afraid to connect with society. You feel a void and uninterested, mostly because you've desensitized yourself or you've trained yourself in a way to not connect with people. Because if you talk to somebody, what that means is you have to actually talk to somebody. That means you, when you ask someone, say, say someone, how's your day going? So I'm going to ask you that question. A lot of the time what's happening is they want to have a conversation with you. Not always. Maybe they're just being friendly. Who knows what they're doing? But the idea is that we're all in a different place. And I know it sounds like on your question that you're not in the best of places. And you're wrestling with some maybe subconscious fears of sort of like what it means to figure out what life is about. But I'm going to tell you right now that you have to overcome your fear. Otherwise, it will get worse. And it will take a very traumatic event like what happened in my life to actually be able to do something about it. So I'm telling you right now, what's happening is you have trained yourself to not connect with people because of fear of connection. And every time you connect with somebody, you feel better. You know, I want to talk more about it. If you leave a comment or if you ask more questions, I'll make another video about it. I'm running out of battery on my camera here and I don't want to lose this recording. So I hope that helps you understand where you're at. Remember, I feel your pain. I know where you're coming from, uh, at least from what I can tell from your question. I hope you understand that, hey, you just have to somehow expand your comfort zone. Do something you fear. Start small, then work your way out. Lean into your fear. All right, thanks for watching. Click like if you haven't already. Subscribe if you're not a subscriber. There's a link for here if you'd like to be on my email list. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps you out.